This is the floor bridge and several variations of the floor bridge. So we're gonna start out with the basic floor bridge where you're gonna lay on the floor. And one important thing I wanna talk about is when you actually raise your hips off the ground, I don't want your rib cage to come off the ground, right? So normally we would drive our elbows into the ground while we're doing this, but just to show you, I'm gonna keep them up here. So we wanna flatten that spine on the ground and we're just going to raise our hips, but we're going to leave our rib cage on the ground. So it will look like this for a body weight floor bridge. You wanna squeeze those glutes at the top. One progression you can do, if you have a band like this or any band really, you can put it around your knees or around your legs just above your knee and drive those knees out as you're coming up. Driving the knees out is going to make the exercise more difficult. Another option, if I say in your program to add a dumbbell, I just have this little pad here. You don't necessarily have to use a pad. You can um, use a rolled up towel or just anything that's gonna protect your hips. You don't necessarily need anything, but it'll just make it a little bit more comfortable. So it's the same movement as the glute bridge. You're just gonna wanna hold on to this dumbbell so that when you come up, it doesn't come rolling back and hitting you in the face. So that's very important. So what we're going to do, drive the knees out, bring the hips up, squeeze at the top and come down slowly. And that is the floor flip bridge and two variations.